Hello and welcome to Wim Hof Daily. Today, I want to talk about some things that I found challenging so far. This is week two for me, and I absolutely love it. I'm addicted to the Wim Hof method, and I'm going to keep going. I finally starting to feel what Wim Hof meant when he said, you feel the power of the cold. You don't feel the cold, you feel the power of the cold. <laughs> okay, I'm just starting to know what he's saying. Okay, so what I want to talk about what I want to talk about today was what I found challenging so far was sometimes it's difficult for me to achieve the oxygenation level that I would like to when I'm doing the conscious breathing. Sometimes I feel it hard to just fully relax. Sometimes I feel it's hard to just reach that level of oxygenation. We just, I just, I'll be breathing and I just don't feel anything. I, I won't feel anything. So I'll have to just focus on relaxing and just having that wave, the, the breath like a wave. So in and out, but not all of the way. And you just want to, you just, for me, it works best when it feels almost effortless, when it's just, it's just happening. And I don't over try breathing so hard. I don't try to gasp or like explode with air. I don't try to like fit as much air as humanly possible in my body. I, just try to make it effortless and I found that that works much better for me than trying to overthink it or trying to over over like just over breathing I don't know how to put it um so I found that it's not that difficult to find to get to the oxygenation level you just have to be relaxed and just have a fluid like a fluent sorry fluid uh fluid motion of breathing just all the way in all the way out without stopping without anything like that okay so the one thing that I found challenging was that was reaching the oxygenation level so if you're having trouble with that it's it's completely normal and you just want to find that happy medium for yourself everybody's a little different so another thing I found really challenging was getting into the cold water Uh, I got into 9 degree water yesterday and I gotta say that was really really intense I think I got a little ahead of myself because I couldn't endure more than a minute of it. After a minute, I had to get out because it became intensely uncomfortable. (laughs) Maybe, maybe I got out a little too early, but I'm gonna stick to gradual cold exposure and getting used to it to try to connect, try to try to accomplish that mind, mind to body connection. But so far, I'm loving it. Wim Hof method doing me really well. I've got I really feel the energy boost, I really feel the mood boost, I, I feel like I lost a lot of varicella, ah, I'm not going to say, I'm not going to try to pronounce that word, <laughs> sorry, but the, the pot belly fat, the visceral fat, I don't know how to say it, excuse me, <laughs> this is not rehearsed, not pre-written, nothing, I just top of my head after I'm done my breathing exercises, I'm about to jump into my cold shower, and I will see you tomorrow. So if you're experiencing any difficulties with achieving the oxygenation, just try to relax more and don't push it, don't force it. It will come, okay? Cold exposure, I suggest you um, do cold exposure gradually, okay? And stick to it, stick to it. And I challenge you, I challenge you to do it daily, every day for at least a week and see what you feel. You're going to feel it. I guarantee you. Okay? Wimp Hop Daily. I will be seeing you soon with more information. I'm going to do a little more research, write some things down, and do a little pre-rehearsed video. Take care, guys. See you soon.